Hi, I'm Roger with Stupid Resins. In this video, I will show you two ways how to render in Final Cut Pro. So let's get it on! Let's start with the first method. So this is the manual method. I have a sample project on my timeline right here. If you see that's on your timeline, that means it's not rendered, okay? So this is the unrendered clip, so it's really choppy. There's a drop frame right there. So what we're gonna do is render the clip and then select your clip. So you can select the top, bottom, or any clip right here so anything above or below that clip will be rendered okay all of it okay and then once i've selected the clip just go to modify and then select render selection and then depending on the effects or transitions or titles you have on your clip this may take longer okay and then go to your background task button up here next to the key just click it and then the background task window will appear so this is where you can see the progress of rendering by the way if you drag your cursor right here on your timeline the rendering will pause okay just let it go to continue rendering okay let's wait for it just be patient patience is key okay it's done you can now exit our background task window and then you can see the dots are now gone up here okay we can now play our clip smoothly oh yeah very very nice it's so smooth now perfect and then the keyboard shortcut for the render selection is Control r once you've selected your clip hit Control r and the rendering will begin okay just go to your background task okay that's good so what if you want to render all of your clips just go to modify and then select render all so this may take longer than the render selection because all of your clips will be rendered okay just sit back and relax click the background task button to see the progress okay and then the keyboard shortcut for the render all is Control shift r okay okay let's wait for it okay that's good so as you can see there are no more dots on our timeline that means everything is rendered okay if this video has been helpful to you go ahead and hit that like button i would really appreciate it for the second method this is the automatic go to your menu bar and then go to final cut pro select preferences and then under playback select background render and then enter any duration you want let's make it three seconds okay so it will start to render in background whenever you are idle meaning you stop working or moving the pointer in final cut pro for that specific time like three seconds okay okay so right now i'm an idle as you can see it start rendering without me doing anything okay just be mindful if you turn this on as this will eat up your storage okay just clear this space after editing by the way i made a video about how to clear this space just go up in this corner right now to check it out okay Thank you for watching and I hope you learned something today. If you want to learn more, I've made a video about how to set up Final Cut Pro. Click here to check it out.